say that seminary is expensive. And how do I save money? Well, you know, you just cut back and you stay in the dorms a little bit longer. And, you know, watch movies and play games with friends instead of going out. Um, also, I work on campus in the dean's office. That helps, too. But mostly when it comes down to it, God's going to provide somehow or another. It's just going to work out. I don't actually go here. I saw a couple of people moving into a building and walked in. One of the rooms was empty. I moved into it and, um, and yeah, I stole a key. So here I am. How do I save money? Well, I mean, my grandmother taught me this one thing that her grandmother taught her, that her grandmother taught her. I think it works very well. Yeah, look, it works. I'm not going to justify it. I mean, it's, it's, you save money. I mean, um, I, mean I, I save money in normal ways. I go and uh, I buy food when it's on sale, and um, I tend to recycle a lot of plastic cups. Um, and some of my plastic, like forks and spoons, I, um, I reuse band-aids. I make my own pillows out of the human hair that I find at the bottom of the shower. Mm -hmm. Oh, and I, I save my uh, fingernail and toe clippings on the back, just in case if I need them. A little help with your friends. That's what really it helps you get through it. So, I support myself by working at the campus store. Um, it's a pretty good job for the most part, though we have some crazy customers that come in. We, we have this, this pile of pins that we give out, and, you know, it's supposed to be one per customer per visit, but do they do that? No. No, of course they don't. They take fistfuls of pins and stick them in their purse. And then, and then, we have these customers that come in and they want a book. And they go, there's this book that I want, and I don't know the name, or the title, or any kind of useful information, but it's blue. Can you help me find it? No. No, I can't help you find your blue book. Sorry about it. Maybe, maybe when you come in with some useful information, I can help you. I wouldn't call it stealing necessarily. I mean, you're allowed to take one per visit. There's just not a limit on how many times you can go in on a day. Do I like my job? Yeah, it's pretty awesome. Why am I wearing glasses? Well, that's easy. I go to seminary, and seminary is all about souls. And thus, if you can see into a person's eyes, you can see into their soul. So I'm kind of like Magneto. I have to protect myself from all the telepaths. How do I pay for seminary? I don't pay for seminary. The pig pays for seminary. Who is the pig, you may ask? Hansel. Hansel is the pig. And Hansel requires sacrifice. And it comes from all. So, did you, uh, did you throw
try your laundry in with mine? Uh, I don't know, I don't know. Who's not? Hey, man. Can I have a dollar? Sure. Hey, Matt! Guess what? I found a shoe that's my size. All right, guys, later. How long have you been in? Today's been a really crazy day. First, somebody comes and steals all my pins at the campus store. And then, somebody steals my wallet. And it has my entire life in there. I don't know what I'm going to do without my wallet. Um, and then, I can't prove it, but I'm pretty sure Brad threw his clothes in with my laundry. Sometimes I wonder why, why I'm here. It's just, people are so weird. Matt's wallet got stolen? Well, that sucks.